Hello friends, welcome back to my recruitment channel. I hope you all are doing great. Friend, in this video, we are going to discuss the amazing topic and the topic name is that how to use each and every option in a Nokri portal, like putting the keyword, exclude keyword, year of experience, notice period and active profile. This is a step by step process. So I will tell you in this video how to use this step by step process to get the relevant profile. This strategy 100% work to get the relevant profile. Please watch the video to till the end. You will understand this process of the recruitment to make the survey. Friend, let's move further. But before that, you have not subscribed my Miss Technical Recruitment channel. So please hit on the subscribe button, like and comment as well. So friends, you will get the video on this my channel related to the recruitment only. Let's move further the page of the nokri.com once i click on the search resume we will find there is a page where we uh, there is a like a page here we need to mark here we need to mention the like mandatory requirement mandatory skill set whatever is required as per our job description so i have already a job description in with the given by the client our requirement is that we need a front end developer uh, the mandatory technologies they have mentioned that is a re having experience either in react angular javascript experience mandatory html css experience is mandatory experience in they need three to eight year location is pan india as per our job description we are uh, now we will make a search so in a keyword let's start with the keyword column in this column let's mention the whatever the words are mandatory just mention html css react next is angular there is a simple rule that whatever the words are mandatory just click on the star button html mandatory css mandatory i am not going to mark the uh, react and angular as star because client has said that we need a person having experience either in react and angular that's why i have not marked react and angular now once i click on the search candidates the resume will come in which the html and css would be mentioned but the resume will come having experience either in react or angular means react or angular just like a any the words will the resume will come having the candidate having experience either in react or angular so there is a simple rule whatever the words you have marked as star so these words are like must or react and angular are not must so either react or angular will be there in the resume of the candidate let's see i just click on the search candidates you will see here like html css in every resume you will find html css is mentioned here also html css mentioned or resumes are there in which having experience either in angular and react because we uh, we have told the look once you click on this arrow you will find that html css are mandatory react and angular are not starred it means the resumes are there having experience either in react and angular once i click on the modify i will go back to the my search so i hope it is clear that whatever words are mandatory just mark click on the star button or if the words are not mandatory just mention that react or angular it means the resume will come having experience in react and angular next uh, uh, is the add exclude keyword exclude keywords means the the word here we need to mention that word which we do not want in the candidate resume like i have mentioned the java because i do not want the candidate having experience in the java technology because our requirement is a front end developer the front uh, i do not want the candidate having experience in java so i have mentioned java in the excluded keyword now there is a different uh, word that it skills i as i have marked the html css as a mandatory keyword okay so here i have a option that if uh, like to mention the experience suppose that html is mandatory i just clicked on the star here we need to mention the experience suppose that i am looking a person having ex having at least one year 
having at least like one plus year experience in the HTML. So I click the, the one plus years. If I click on the CSS as a star or mention the experience like one plus year. So here like we have an option that we can uh, just mention the experience range of the technology. So I, I want the candidate having experience in HTML CSS uh, at least like one plus year. Okay. So we can mention the experience of the technology. We can mention the other IT skills as well. Like uh, if I want the React, so I can click on the React as well. But I do not want the React because our requirement is just having experience either in React and Angular. So I hope that it is clear that here we need to mention the experience range of the required IT skills. Experience, uh, uh, experience the, uh, the client has given that is a 3 to 8 year. So let me mention 3 to 8 year. Okay. Location, I have, uh, location they have given the pan India. So click anywhere in India. Suppose that our requirement is that only Pune location is there. So just simply mention the Pune and click on the include candidate who prefer to relocate the above location means uh, the candidate now the resume will come whose preferred location is Pune wherever they are sitting anywhere in India they are if they are ready to relocate to the Pune so that resume will also appear in our search okay so now I am not going to click on the Pune location because our requirement is anywhere in India I just simply click on anywhere in India salary range uh, they have not mentioned the budget actually let me take the idea experience range is 3 to 8 years so I have mentioned the 20 lakh per annum and here like 8 lakh per annum in this like we can mention 8.5 as well in the previous version of the Nukri the option was not available of the 0.5 in the new version we have seen the 8.5 and 20.5 in 0.5 also we can like make our search so we have found this uh, option in the new version of the Nogri.com. Here another version option that include candidates who did not mention their current salary. Some candidates are also available in the market that who do not like to mention their current package. So if I click on this button, so I will get the resume in which their current salary is not mentioned. But I do not want to click on this. Okay. In the employment details. There are many like uh, functions are available like what functional area our, our requirement is like engineering and software. We are looking at engineering person okay hardware and network whatever you can choose the IT and information security. If I click on the engineering so you will find the further uh, like options available. Anyways, I do not want to mention uh, anything in the functional area. Industry, what kind of industry? Either it is IT services, consulting or BPO, analytics. So I want the candidate like from the background of IT services and consulting. So I click on this. Company, uh, if I want to uh, like uh, in the company, you can mention that I want the candidate from the TCS company. So you will uh, once you click on the TCSO, the resume will come who's who are working currently in the TCS company. Once I click on the bullion, so you can mention that uh, like uh, current company, previous company, current previous company means the person have worked earlier or currently working in the TCS. That resume will come if my if I want a person currently working in the TCS, so I can click on the this button. If here another option is add the exclude company suppose that I'm working for the entity data company so I do not want candidate currently working in the entity data so I will click on this I click on the boolean search there uh, so I do not want the ex candidate of the entity data as well means the I do not want the person uh, who have uh, like worked in the entity previously as well so I will click on this button Anyways, I'm going to remove this TCS because my like uh, I want the every candidate working in like apart from the TC entity data company. So I have removed this. Here, if you want to mention the designation, like if I want a person whose current designation mentioned as a front end developer, so I will click on the front end developer. 
like front end developer trainee developer uh, like analyst in this way i can mention the designation well i'm not going to click on this because designation doesn't matter whatever the like uh, these mandatory skill set mentioned that is mandatory okay next uh, is the notice period like uh, if i want a person having exp uh, like in, this is a like new option in the nokri portal like uh, i can find a person having exp uh, having notice period more than 3 month 1 month 2 month 0 to 15 days 3 month my requirement is like that i uh, i'm like looking a person having uh, like uh, the notice period max up to one month so i just clicked on 0 to 15 days one month and currently serving notice period in education we also have the multiple options like if we i want a person if you want a person any ug qualification pg qualification so you can click on this so my requirement is not like that like here it is not mentioned something related to the uh, like education okay in the diversity and additional details you will find like uh, sometimes we get the requirement in which only the female candidates are required so i may click on this button if the male candidates are required so here uh, we can click on male anyways i'm going to click on the all candidates okay candidate category we can like if i am looking a person the category having st sc so we can choose this option age of the candidate suppose that uh, like we do not want the person having age more than 50 year so you can mention this here job type and employment type like uh, if uh, if the job the show candidate seeking means uh, the per, if the can the show only those candidate who are looking for the permanent job so i will once i click on this option so i will find the cvs who are seeking the role for permanent opportunity okay in the diversity details like uh, what kind of candidates you want like all the candidates are yeah, newly registered in the nokri portal or or they have modified the resume so we can like click on this option as per our wish so i want the, all the candidates here also we have option like show only candidates with verified mobile number attached resume verified email id you can click uh, like uh, verified email id but i now i have put all the like uh, required details in our search box okay here i have mentioned the keywords like whatever the keywords are required excluded keywords it skills i have mentioned now let me click on the search candidate here we will find the relevant resume like i have found the 13550 1350 we have found the resume okay okay here one option one is also there like javascript i have not mentioned the javascript in my search you can once you click on here so you will find that what exactly i have mentioned html css react angular but javascript i have not mentioned so i will refine here we have option to refine further here I'm going to mention the JavaScript in different different way. Like candidate can mention the JavaScript in two to three ways. So I have mentioned JavaScript by uh, without any gap by giving the hyphen and by giving the gap like JavaScript. Uh, uh, okay, I have done mistake. JavaScript. Okay, I just click on the refine search now. I have mentioned these words javascript in a different different way because candidate can write in any way now i'm going to click on the refine search okay some error occurred let me check what is the error okay 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 javascript now let me click on the search refine search so i have found the relevant resume now look guys so like all the all the resumes containing the html css javascript also there here there you have option active in like looking a person who is currently active in last like within 30 days so once i click on this look the resume the quantity of the resume has reduced to 873 the new options are also available here like uh, 
I just show you some option like to forward further if I want to forward this resume further I can uh, forward it if I want to save this resume add to the regex folder if I click on the regex folder and mention the name no folder added first I need to create another one I click on the front end developer so it means I have moved this resume into my folder so like if I do not have a time but I am really liking this profile so I can move this resume in the in the regex folder created by me okay so I can later on like check it so I hope guys like uh, you might have if you have any query related to making the search then please do let me know in the comment box I will clarify this okay you will see that in all the resume uh, we have uh, like CSA JavaScript uh, is mentioned as per our requirement we have made the relevant search now we can start uh, profiling and screening okay if you have any doubt doubt please let me know guys Thank you for watching this video. It, today topic is done. Please subscribe my channel also if you have liked this.